those birds that were on the pool the other day were on the first day. I actually left him. I think I'll be in a cock block. See you later. Welcome to episode 4. Well, I am obviously going in here. These birds got zero fear. I made a mistake. These man trying to rob my food now. And I'm planning something. That's what I thought. Fly away camp. Go. Minority right there. Come on, Brad. Be brave. Okay. It's a little gap, but it's cosy. When the house was lived in, there were no railings upstairs, and the trap door was lowered to make a complete floor in the bedroom. Let's have a look upstairs. Mine must have been straight on the lumber. Well, it is fucking little, like. That speaking thing just said, man who lived here was six foot three. Fuck. When the house was lived in, there were no railings upstairs, and the trap door was lowered to make. Why would that have been here? This house was built in the 16th century. I'm out. I'm not going to get any more. Ah, that's brilliant. Thank, Thank you. Cheers. Nice round here, it's better when it's not raining though. Uh, how long does the check take to clear? You need to give it five days, five working days before you can do one. Okay. Catch me outside. How about that? Five working days. It's a bit fucking shit that is. Being paid by a check is strange, isn't it? Some PR Flintstones technology that is. This place is so much prettier when it's not fucking raining. Be doing an open mic in there soon. You'll see me. Excuse me, sign. How would you describe semen? Well, Conway's a nice place. I do like it here. I went around the castle walls with Callum. I'll put a link to that vlog in the description. That was a lot of fun. Look at this place, man. Nice, man. It literally feels like I'm walking through a fairy tale, like, it is nice, I do like it here. But today is Friday, Friday, I have my baby. I'm gonna go get them. I'll talk to you after. Time on that, what time it is. Good timing. No. You're gonna suck my D. And when you think you're not giving me head, you know I'm the drag you all. I didn't hear the no that was said and the judge will let me on yeah. I'ma fuck your mouth and then your bum hole cause that's how I do bum I'm gonna suck my dick 
gonna fuck your bum. You're gonna suck it to you. That's fucking gross and you might die. Sure, far away to get E. coli. Now show me where you piss from. To show me where you piss from. Out. Just show me when you get spoiled. You're gross. Do you like the romance? No. Oh, I shit. love you. You're not nice. Will you marry me to an attractive Taiwanese lady so she could get into the country for free? Would you marry me if you were ordained? Or would you be selfish and fucking lame? You need to tell me please Would you marry me if I got down on one knee to you? Got up and I tied my shoe Would it I'd be so make angry, you cry? Especially if we were somewhere, like say we went to Paris and you'd done it And I know you will I know you'll do it I'm gonna tie my shoe for you But baby what you don't realise is the bunny ears of the rings count them shit There's two Metaphors, son, like tying the shoe is like tying the knot between me and you. Oh my god, is this why you really love me, or is this just the reason that you wanna fuck me? If it went, goes anywhere, I'll sue you. It won't go anywhere, so you don't need to sue me. Oh, bitch, jump on me and do me. <laughs> Can we go bar for bar, please? No, I can't. We know this. I eat your pussy, cause it's red nose meat. Oh. I ain't talking about no comic relief. I mean, how you wish you shedding? Means I don't get as much fun in bed But I still get head cause C to G And that is why I'm gonna marry thee in the vows Oh but like well, the way she opens her mouth It was good until she was 21 Then you know my now was very gone <laughs> I ran away, but then I come back Cause she started opening the crap That's disgusting, I'm oh, sorry That's a whole other story about me Have you give me a real kiss? You're fucking ugly Why don't you love us? Cause of that <laughs> Why? Because like it's all come up away at the back here, so this doesn't like bunch up with it. Yeah. I know more about your fucking place than you do. What your fucking place? Did you make me breakfast? No, you promised me you'd make me breakfast. Yeah, I know, but I told a lie, so can you make me some scrambled eggs or something? No! Nope. You promised you'd make me breakfast. But that was a lie. I told your dick, you said you'd make me breakfast. Oh. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> what did you say? I said that you promised if I don't think <laughs> What thing? Even yeah, this sounds like some casting couch shit, doesn't it? <laughs> I promise you'll get a job after. So, do you really make me breakfast? <laughs> you want mayonnaise? Yeah, mayonnaise and bourbons. Yummy. It's breakfast of a hero. So, the police just phoned me and she said that they've caught the man that broke my window. Uh, but he's in hospital at the minute. <laughs> yeah, man's in hospital. Um, so they can't question him. Uh, they asked him why he did it and he said he was just having a bad day and my car was there. Well, obviously I hope man's not terminal, but I do hope that he's... He, he's fell down the stairs, he's broke his legs or something. Like, she, she said he got on well. So he's in hospital. He should be out. So I'm not going to have any more of an update in, in, in two and a half weeks or whatever. Like from when she's back on holiday. Um, obviously, I don't actually wish ill harm on him. I don't want him to die. Um, but uh, I don't know. Wouldn't be the end of the world if we got like the MRSA or something. <laughs> <laughs> nah. But yeah, whatever. It's karma, isn't it? So you for being a fucking dickhead, isn't it? Breaking my window and being a cunt in hospital. Um, whatever in it. Uh, hope he gets better because I want s some repercussions for this shit. Like, fucking absolute bellend. But yeah, that's a. Uh, that's a thing. Oh. Just make me coffee, please. No. I'll put you on a cockburn. I already am for a week. <laughs> okay, that's it. <laughs>